and we just printed a crazy car. I'm going to show you in three, two, one. Welcome back, Cops. My name is Global Cup, and I have always wondered if it's possible to 3D print a car. So that's what we're gonna do in today's video. Right over here, I have a 3D printer. Printed some cool things like this before. This is a uh, 9 million subscriber play button. It's pretty awesome. And now it's time to print a car. Managed to steal the blue, blue. I managed to steal some Ferrari blueprints. So let's give it a shot. And boom. We're gonna download a car. I found this toy car. I think we should definitely start with a little car, a little toy car. And uh, if it does well, we can upgrade it and we can turn it into a sicker, sicker, way sicker car. Get a bigger 3D printer and everything else. But first, let's try this toy car. The car has illegally been downloaded. Now it's time to turn the printer on. How does this work? Print gear car one. Okay, there we go. It's gonna take about an hour to print. So uh, let's uh, let's hope it goes it goes well. And if it doesn't, yeah, and if it doesn't, then they'll suck. They'll really suck. They'll be right back. One hour later, and the printing is done. I can see something from over here, but we're gonna need to take a closer look because this just looks silly. Okay, cop. So there is our car. This thing just it doesn't what that is not a car this is not a car i just managed to take it off the plate yeah this is not a car i mean it looks like a very very basic car it worked okay let me let me take the bottom off then you can see it better there we go i kind of pulled it off and it broke and it snapped yeah good job there jordy trying to print a car we need we need a better template this is not working we need to download a better car the FBI just came to my house. They asked me, Jordy, what are you doing? I said, I'm 3D printing a car. I stole it. They said, you're not allowed to 3D print a car. I said, what you gonna do about it, huh? We found a different car model right over here. I call this one the Beetle because Beetles are cool. We're gonna try to print this one. First, we're gonna start with a miniature version of it, a very, very little one. If we like that miniature version, we're gonna upgrade it. We're gonna print a way bigger one. If we like that big version of it, then we're gonna print a mass save one a one-on-one -on -one size and we're gonna try to drive it so uh let's go cop let's download this car it's funny because it's 2018 and i'm saying let's download a car download this car and let's print this bad boy Here's a better view of how the car is going to be printed. It's going to be printed on its side. This says it's going to take eight hours. We're going to print a simpler version of this, please. Maybe half the size. That is going to take an hour 45. Still too much. We need a very basic one. 30% of the size, 36 minutes. That sounds way better. Let's give this a shot. In about half an hour time, we should have something which looks like this coming out of this. To be honest, I think it's gonna completely fail and it's gonna look horrible. But hey, at least we're trying. Cops, we have good news and bad news. And uh, the good news is that there is no good news and the bad news is this is what we ended up printing. It took half an hour and this printed. How did this happen? I have no idea. I think that happens if we're trying to print something too little, too fast. So instead, I'm gonna adjust the blueprint right over here. I'm just gonna make it a, uh, a you know, like a two hour long print. I'm about to leave the house anyway. Anyways, so I'm gonna let it print for a few hours and then hopefully when we come back we have something better Hopefully see you in three hours What I've done is I've made this thing a little bit bigger now about twice as bigger in, in length width and height on top of that I'm printing it with a print support structure is what it's called. I'm about to leave the house So we're gonna see what's gonna happen. Hopefully everything's gonna go great If not, then we'll see because I still want to print a car today I still want to print a car today and this is gonna take three hours Hours. It's already 4 p.m. I've been working for hours on this video. This is crazy. Bye bye printer. See you in three hours. Cops, I have some really bad news. First of all, it's boiling hot in my office. I just came to look at the um, at the 3D printing here, and something went wrong, and it, it went horribly wrong. I hope my machine uh, hasn't completely broken. But uh, look at this. Look at that. Yeah pile of uh, goo over there. I'm just gonna take this out. It started off, you know, printing pretty nicely and then it turned into some chewing gum thing. You go to the, uh, wow, okay, no, I gotta, I gotta clean this up. So, so that completely failed. That really didn't go well. I think next up, uh, what I'm gonna have to try is do it a little bit slower. But I don't know how well this is gonna go. You know, I, 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 to be honest, I think we're gonna completely fail, but I'm still gonna try. 
I'm still gonna try. Turns out that the uh, the machine stopped itself, probably because they realized that it was broken and nothing was happening. Uh, so it completely stopped itself. Let's check it out right now. I actually haven't followed it much at the start. It seems to be putting down the platform right now. I'm gonna be checking in on it in a little bit. Um, but the new plan is to print it at half the speed, 50% uh, 50 of the speed. If that doesn't work, then I'm gonna have to improvise because I wanna I wanna put this video out here and I don't wanna I don't wanna disappoint you cops and say that it's impossible to print a car. Okay? I'm pretty sure it's not impossible. Nothing is impossible to print. Maybe a few things are. Love, for example. Actually, no, I can come up with a few ways to print love too. Yeah. So be right back, I'll I'll keep you cups up to date. Cops, we are off to a great start. But I mean, that's what we did last time. There's one problem though. It says, uh, it says it right here. It's gonna take us 47 hours. 47 hours to print a car this big. Yeah, that's, that's, uh, I think that's incorrect. But we'll, we'll see once it starts printing some more. We're gonna get a really nice car out of this. 100%. I promise you, we are gonna get this awesome car right now. Come on, print the car. Please, we need this. We need this car. We need it. I need to be able to drive it to work. Actually, literally, my work is right here, so that's kind of like, yeah, nope, nope. 30 hours later, we only have 16 hours left, and um, apparently, it's starting to look pretty good over here. I don't know if you can see, like, some wheels poking out. It's happening, finally. It is happening. It's gonna be all night before this thing is done printing. Uh, so I'm just gonna chill, I'm just gonna wait, and I'll keep you guys up to date, but I believe that we're finally doing it. We're finally printing a car. A few hours later, and I walk into the office, and all of a sudden, the, um, the machine, it stopped printing. Why? I have absolutely no idea. So let's, let's take a look. Wow. Okay, so we can see a little bit of the outside of the car. I'm pretty sure everything is going great. I'm just confused why it stopped printing. Okay, I just pressed resume print. I have zero clue why it stopped printing. There's enough material, there's enough of everything. So, why would, why would it stop? Why would it stop? Do you not want us to print a 3D car? never had this. I printed quite a few things. Look, here's my little collection. And then we also have the play button. I don't know why it's not working. I am absolutely clueless. I have no idea what's happening. I cannot seem to get it to work anymore. It literally stopped. It just stopped out of nowhere. I'm aborting the print right now. I I'm pretty sure that 3D printers still work. That's the weird thing. Maybe the file is corrupt. The printing file could be corrupt. Anyways, this is what we managed to print. The start of a pretty nice car. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to grab the file again and just start printing again, I guess. This is this is literally all we got. And it looks so nice. It looks so cool. And here we go. This is what the car looks like from the side. This is from the front, but it just stopped printing. Why did it stop printing? Unless this was all that was gonna give you know, this is all we're gonna get. Perhaps I think um there's only one more thing we can do. Print a car 10 times as big. So I'll see you in two days once the printer is done. Oh my God, cops, two days later and the printing is done. We just printed a crazy car. I'm gonna show you in three, two, one. Oh my God, look at this car. We just printed this car. This is literally insane. Insane. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna put it right over here. I'm just joking, cops. I, uh, I spent a very long time trying to print the car. This is all we got. Uh, let me know, what should we print next? As some of you cops told me to print the Quibble Cup logo, so I might do that in the next video. Printing a car, a car is definitely very, very complex, and it's much harder than I was expecting it to be, uh, but at least I had fun. And we have one little souvenir, which we got from this video. You know, the side of a red car. Anyways, Cubs, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you Cubs in the next video. Bye-bye.
Hey Google, turn on studio. Okay, turning the studio on.